Happy Wednesday, everyone, and welcome to another episode of What's the Tea with the ASC. Thank you to my fabulous co-hosts for joining me this week and every week. Now, last week, Blue Sky upped the ante and offered a $50 gift card for anyone who participated in trivia. So, Diana, why don't you tell us what the question was and who the winner was? Well, good morning, April, and the, my fabulous co-hosts. The question last week was, what idol season did Jennifer Hudson participate in? And the answer was three. And the winner, we had out of a number of, of applicants last week, or a number of folks that participated, is Miss Stephanie Richardson. So Ooh. congratulations, Stephanie. That is so awesome. Congrats, Stephanie. And um, Diana will be in touch to get you your gift card. So thank you so much for participating. Now, Diana, why don't you tell us what our question is this week? Why is spring called spring? Mm -hmm. That's a good one. <laughs> Tis the season. <laughs> why is spring called spring? I love it. All right, everybody put your comments in the answers below. Um, so this week is going to be a $10 Starbucks gift card up for grabs. All right, now. Craig, you and I have talked a little bit about this camping trip that's coming up. Uh, let's tell everybody a little bit more about that. Yeah, absolutely. So it's uh, the AASC camping trip. It's a great opportunity to reconnect with nature as well as your fellow AASC members. So um, yeah, and it's, uh, it's, it's filling up fast. So if you do want to reserve a spot, April 15th, tax day is the last time to make sure, make sure you reserve your spot. So get on to the website and uh, get it done. Love it. More deadlines than one. Tax day. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah. All right. Uh, now, when is this camping trip? So it'll be in August, August 13th through the 15th down at the Pueblo Reservoir, also known as the Colorado Springs Ocean. Um, <laughs> there will be information on the website about which loop and cost. So uh, stay tuned. All right. Love, 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 love it. That's so exciting. Um, now, April, we have something really fun coming up this Friday too, right? Yes, yes. So it's actually going to be next Friday. So April 9th, the Colorado Apartment Association, the first Friday of every month is still offering coffee with a lawyer. Um, so this has been a free member benefit that we have started um, with the Colorado Apartment Association since COVID um, began. And so we have some industry experts. We have Deb Wilson with Springman Braden and then Vic Solzer with Cheddar Solzer. And so they're getting on there to answer questions, give you an hour of their time to update you as laws change, and then just really answer any questions if you have any specific questions. So if you haven't taken advantage of this yet, make sure to um, sign up on our website, totally free and a really, really great opportunity to get those questions answered. Awesome. It's wonderful to stay on top of that, especially with everything changing so much in the last year yeah. and still. <laughs> yeah. Um, all right, cool. Well, now time for our very fun new segment, People on the Move. We've got some real juicy ones this time. Yes. So I'm so excited for our first one um, to announce that our board member and member of our executive committee, Tony Moyes, has been promoted from a regional manager to vice president over Colorado and Kansas. So we are just so excited for her. She's such a great um, board member and member to have as a part of the association and just very proud of her promotion. So congratulations, Tony. Yay, Tony, taking OPA. Yeah. Congrats, Tony. And then uh, following that, GB actually had their awards, and uh, here are some of the results. So, best multifamily property peak performance goes to 333 Eco. Um, regional manager of the year, uh, congrats, Dee Dee Young. And then property manager of the year, congrats to Tammy Scrivener at Palinoma Terrace. And uh, yeah, Diana, congrats. would you mind? taking the, the following three? I can do that for you, Craig. Thank you. <laughs> Service Manager of the Year, Sean Harris at Shannon Glenn. Groundskeeper of the Year, Greg, my baby Greg. <laughs> Press, and Rookie of the Year, Brooke Davis, Pines at Broadmoor Bluffs. Big congratulations to all of you. Wonderful job. Congrats, guys. That's so exciting. And it's so wonderful to, to be appreciated and to see all of your hard work be recognized. Um, all right. Well, I think that's almost all we have today. Uh, just to recap trivia, Diana, what is our question this week? Why is the spring season called spring? <clears throat> okay. Why is spring spring, guys? Put your answers in the comments below to win. One more thing before we go. 
Uh, just a quick side note, the apartment association offices have been closed for quite a while uh, due to COVID, but guess what? They are open again. Very exciting. Um, and then the team really wanted to just put out a little well, PSA to kind of remind everybody that the apartment association offices are for everybody to use and with them open again, they're able to offer that again as a wonderful co-working space. So for you vendors, for you suppliers out there who are taking calls from Safeway parking lots and uh, from your car like me right now, <laughs> not a supplier, but still, uh, then the apartment association offices are actually available to you again to use as a co-working space. It's really everybody's office. Also, they have great hot cocoa. So make yeah. sure that you pop over uh, and Say hi to everybody and really take advantage of that member benefit. All right. Well, I think that's everything we've got this week. Thank you so much for joining us. Happy Wednesday. And thank you for joining us every week for What's the Tea. Have a great week. Have a great week. week.